battling against the system. I turned and dissed them. The policies are policies are back is back. So let's all get off remorse and stab back. Going all alone is just weak, weak, yeah. This ain't no joke. I'm bubbling, I'm bubbling. So glue off, move off, stop, drop, drop, troubling me. My name's Norm Ski, and I'm gonna take you on a mini tour. Uh, I think it's yeah, time yeah. to make the floor burn. Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome to the Loop Pink Freaking Dance and your house party. Freaking. Yeah, where we got sleep, beats, jeep, beats, beat, beat, freaking beats, all Please kinds of beats. Beat. Bass! Wow, the weather, this is really happening. Francis Wilson, respect! <laughs> respect, Norm Ski. <laughs> Yo, 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 this is Normski and we are the Star Squad. Right now I'm in plain clothes as you can see, very plain. Anyway, we're in Manchester, it's wet, it's rainy and we're going indoors into Affleck's Palace to find out who's wearing what and when. Well, finally we're here, the one and only DJ Premier. This is Mr Normski, Normski. Bad boy Normski. Bad boy yeah. Stu Guinness. What's up, this is me, Mr Normski, out and about for the Killer Killer Live podcast. What are you doing here? I'm about to get ready for the podcast and have some fun and play <laughs> myself. <laughs> Sitting next to me is an unsung hero in my mind, deep in the underbelly of London and its creative community hub, is a man that has like not only set precedence to documenting some of the most earliest of urban and street cultural pieces and artists, but he also is a bit of a celebrity. Bah. From big one thing or another to dance energy to house party to board stupid to split kingdom. Normski. Yes, yes. Mr. Normski. Not bad, man. Nice introduction. Very nice. Wow. Keeping it like that, Sin, are you in trouble? Oh, <laughs> I should have recorded, recorded that. In fact, yeah, I'll take that as you. It is recording, isn't it? Yes. Thank you for having me. It's really nice to see you and be here. From my experiences, which, as you know, isn't very much with regard to <laughs> things on the broadcast level, <laughs> I, I do remember Dance Energy, um, which you know, a TV format, a magazine format, um, which the majority of things to this day that, you know, Facebook and everything, they're all magazine formats. One thing I, I do really wonder is, is that in 1991, when I was on Dance Energy, BBC Two programme, which was a magazine format style music um, programme, we had uh, three, on each 30 minute show, we had three performances, three uh, live performances, as far as uh, we always insisted that the vocals had to be done live. Three times five minutes, 15 minutes, and that's already half of your TV show. Yeah, it's 30 right. minutes long. Yeah. Or do you, so you you break up the radio performances with stuff like, oh, we've got a feature about Hacienda Club. Yeah. Oh, there's Lisa Hansen. She's going to do the thing about the club talk yeah, in that part of England. Yeah. We go to that for four and a half minute items. Uh, you know, that was a... Uh, uh, a piece, a shoot that would have been done, you know, and then that would be cut into it, and then you know, and then there's all this little sessions. Then you had Normski Star Squad, so I go out I to Star, Star Squad, Star Squad. Um, and in the studio, coming back to what we we're saying about ballroom and stuff, and, and not dissing anyone in any particular way, uh, with regards to just the difference between the generations, if you like. So in 1991, when we were doing the studio stuff with the uh, the, 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 the performances, we'd get crowds in, yeah. you know, not huge, huge crowds, as big as they get on some of these, you know, modern day um, broadcasts, but we get a, a studio audience. Yeah. Uh, it, you, you would really be in the audience because you looked great and you could dance. <clears throat> uh, it didn't matter what color, shape, you know, sex or anything so like that. Moving. But you definitely, yeah. get, you know, and you were selected by us actually having club um, researchers that uh, also worked as the club researchers on the TV show and part of their duty was just to go and gather um, audience so they would go to different clubs and some of these people that worked on the show weren't all from London so they could bring into so the whole thing really represented uh, and um, that's and amazing and then, and then also sometimes you'd have people that were coming because there was a particular maybe a youth club or something I think we had that a couple of times in the country and they'd get, we'd literally get a coach load of Coventry kids that came into the studio with some kids that were from London and but there were never maybe more cross pollinating than 60, and making scenes 60 70 people at the most and so what we did and one of the main rules was is, is do not film anything that is shit This is uh, straight up now. We're about to do something from the light to the darker because it's all no, no. about the permanent marker. That's right. That's right. None of these are being used right here. It's all. Uh, it's all uh, for other people. It's not for us because uh, we use these things here. Yeah, it's from the heart. It's from the body. It's from the throat. It's from the mind. Yeah, Mr. Normski in the place. Yeah, human beatbox, killer killer on your taste. Spitkingdom.com in the place. Yeah.
Check it, check it, check it, check it, check it, yeah. For the worldwide crew of hip hop and beats and pleasure, check it. Coming, uh, coming, uh, coming, uh, still the vibe, cause you know we're rolling in it. Come here to win it, straight from the tip top, you don't stop the mind, the pleasure as the vibe drop. We've got it going, killer killer's flowing, now we're taking styles, microphone check in the poem, check the cut. Yeah. Uh. Ooh. When people say the name Normsky, a whole load of stuff just comes just into comes their minds. It's ridiculous. You That's say amazing. Goldie or something, and everyone just. You know. I put you in the same category as a Goldie or a Wiley. Yeah. Well, in terms of iconic, like. D- 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 output. Yeah, I mean, w- Wiley's like. Um, probably got a, another t- 20 odd years before he's my age yeah. and it takes so something I keep saying to people and this is a really good thing this is why I don't understand people that are rushing through their life so quickly and don't really live a full life and things happen I know but really really need to really like, understand how special it is but mm-hmm. um, it takes a lifetime to create a history mm-hmm. and sometimes some history is a short lived life and it's incredible what they've created within that <laughs> 